Hey everybody, this is Jerichos, and welcome back to Creature in the Well. Okay, that was cool. I didn't even realize. We got a new charge blade last time that has a really long range. Very helpful. Not that we need it, because we've already activated the monolith, and we're going inside the synchronous field area. Oh, hey, orbs. You coming with me? Let's go. <laughs> This game is kind of silly at times, and I love it. So let's see what awaits us. But good to know that this is now the teleporter, and once you activate it, you can jump straight to the end to get around. Although you can't seem to jump back to the beginning from the teleporter, but that's fine because, you know, you just go back to the main room with the temple and go from there. These have a lot of, I'll call it health. Where are we going now? This is slightly creepy. Ooh. Okay, we activate those. Oh! Oh, oh, oh. Ow, ow. Yikes. Oh, what the? What the heck? Okay, note to self. Don't stand so close to those when you hit them. I think I must have spawned those little red star things, and I, since I was right next to it, they just hit me immediately. Alright, let's go back in. Heal up. And try this again. That was, um... That was not a good start. <laughs> but no big deal. We thankfully have infinite lives. Gosh, I couldn't even imagine this game with a live system. Now, uh, I don't need to actually hit this. I've already farmed through that one and that one took a little while. Let's see. I'll go ahead and open the door, but I want to clear this out. Okay. Let's see if I get these charged up. Oh, yikes. Oh, yeah, those absolutely do. Oh, hey! Got it. But yeah, those, the ones that spawn from here that honestly look like a Fall Guy face, those do indeed spawn... Oh, what is this? The stars that chase you. Alright, so there. Stuff to hit over here is. Well, let's get it all. Sure. Hey, nice job. Um, wow, this is very spread out. Uh, I'm going right first. Ooh. Ooh, super dark. Got it. Clear that out. I know I don't have to clear everything, but I kind of want to get every room done at least once. I don't know. For all I know, there's some sort of trophy for 100%ing every room. Ah, okay. Okay. Did I get it? I did. Okay. Whew. This is so neat how they've got, like, booby trap ones. You know, ones you want to hit and ones that if you hit them accidentally, they cause problems. Okay. These also don't seem to ricochet back straight ahead. this. Okay. You guys just leave me alone. <laughs> I'm not sure I care as much for the chain blade. It's nice, but 
I think... Hmm. We do fan blade for a little bit just to get some health back. Especially because I got so many of these that are shooting red at me. Oh, another of this room. Uh oh. Ah! I see what those things are now. They're the things that oof, shoot the red ones at me, so of course they're tracking. That's why they kind of turn. They're just recessed at the moment. I get it. I get it, game. I love these just dark rooms. Such a brilliant aesthetic. Ooh, ow. Okay. Oh, I was really worried about sitting right next to those, um, like, pulse things. I don't like those EMP towers. I honestly don't know if that's even what they're called, but that's, that's what I'm calling them. Now, move back. Did we get everything to the right? We did, cool. Time to go the other way and explore to the left. You know, I mentioned before that the music is more atmospheric, but the music in this area is a little... I mean, it's still atmospheric, but it's got kind of a bit of a catchy bit to it. All right, build it full up. Come on, here we go. Yes. I love having the lightning staff for these rooms now. Just feels so good. Hmm. Let's go left first this time. I'm gonna end up exploring them all anyway. Ooh. Ooh. Like, ah, got it, but nope, nope, get out of my way. Yeesh. This is a mean area. Hmm. Did it? Did I screw it up? I think maybe I did. Ah, uh, yeah, I've, okay, here's a case. I want the chain blade. Ah, uh, darn it. I've got to hit it and then catch it. Got it. Okay, this is tricky. But it's not hard. Whew. No, darn it. You know what? I wonder. Right? Ah, oh, darn, I thought I could cheese it. Chain blade is definitely what I want with this, because I gotta catch them before they hit those. Are we gonna do it? Are we gonna do it? We did it! Whew! Get in there. Hit those things. Oh! Secret path! That. That was unusually stressful. <gasps> Magnetic fork. What is this? powerful magnet that attracts any nearby ball. Is that, that's a charge tool. Oh. And when you know, that would have been perfect for this previous room. Okay, maybe not. It doesn't seem to be attracting it quickly. But I'll still try it out for a bit. Okay. Ow. Got 
Got it. Okay. I am not sure how I feel about the magnetic fork. Maybe it'll shine better in, you know, a little bit, but for now, at least, it's only so-so. Also, holy cow, I just realized how low on health I am. You know what? Get a little bit of this. I love the chain lightning on these. Perfect. Get out of there. Oh, I just saw we have over 300,000 energy. Um, I think this is the way we haven't gone yet. Yes. charge. I have no idea what these ones would have done if I had gotten them, but I'm glad I never hit them. I could really use a healing. Come on, game. You sometimes hear me when I ask for this. Not hearing me this time. Just giving me some free energy. Well, I'll take it. This is probably going to be a challenge room. Let's go past it. I'll come back and clear it in a second, but give me healing? No. I really... Oh! I really should equip the one that heals again. Thirty thousand, beautiful. Okay, and let it rip. Nope. When I said let it rip, I did not mean rip my head off. Oh, we're almost four hundred thousand. There's going to be an expensive door up ahead, isn't there? There's no way they're letting me just stock four hundred thousand energy to go do upgrades with you know no worries whatsoever. Although, I just realized, did we... Yeah, we fully did everything on the side paths. Beautiful. Oh. Okay, I, I gotta. I gotta take a moment. Full charge. Haha. <laughs> so satisfying. So yeah, even if we die, we're back on the main path and it would take us no time at all to get forward. 240,000. I knew it. I knew there was going to be a big giant door cost. Game, you know how to treat me right. You do. Uh, let's see. Do we have... It looks like it's a straight shot at this point. Oh, what is... This is interesting. Seriously, these rooms don't really have to be cleared, I feel like. Because there's no, you know, orb um, generator thing that you have to get. But I just like clearing them out. Also, do these have a... Is this a side path? No. But this is. Huh, that wasn't on the map. Ooh, another secret passage. Synchronous Field Banner. An emblem of the bot C tech engineers who manage the collective consciousness and interface of the entire robot collective. Neat. Let's head out and back to our main path. We also got that nice old core for an upgrade. It is a starless night in this darkness, engineer. Inside the mountain, I rule absolutely, and I have brought that gift to the people of Mirage. These machines will bring light back into the world, and I will not allow it. How interesting that the desert city is called Mirage. You know what? Now that I know how these work, we've got a ton of energy. We've got a core. I'm going to jump ahead and head, or not jump ahead, <laughs> jump back. Let's go upgrade. Uh, 
130,000. Nice. I know, Danielle. <laughs> Alright, level 8. What's the next one take? 160,000. Who boy. But, got ourselves an upgrade. Should make taking on the boss just a little easier. Since we can jump right through here. This is just such an interesting little area with the different ways you kind of have stuff that's dangerous to activate. And, oh, this is a slightly different layout here. Of course. Alright, full charge, because nothing seems to be attacking us. Ooh, only thing attacking is me attacking myself. Ow. Got it. Yikes. I've got to be very careful here. Okay. Um, you gonna... Okay, you give me some of those. Cool. Ow. Nope, 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 nope. I knew I wasn't getting out of there in time. Okay. Rough. But I knew it was gonna be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep flinging me out, but I keep coming back for more. Oh, I just realized we probably want to heal up first. <coughs> there we go. So, fully healed, and I think I don't want the fan blade. I want... We'll do the chain blade. Catch stuff before it hits those pulse towers. Yes! These big sweeping attacks. Okay. Full charged. And I need to just be ready to get the heck out of dodge. I probably shouldn't stand in the middle. I should stand, like, kind of off to the side. It's interesting, the one... Oop, ow, ow, ow. Uh, the one I actually chain lightning seems to... Uh, take more damage than the one I hit directly. Alright. Okay. Did we... Nope. What am I missing? Oh, over there. Got it. Okay. Is this the final floor? Waiting for something to shoot at me? Ah, you're gonna shoot at me. Yeesh. No. Stop doing that. No, whatever. I'll just keep dodging him. I see your plan. Got it. We did it! Whew. Creature withdraws. Nasty, nasty creature. And... <laughs> Let's just bounce it all around. They'll eventually hit something. Backup power. Ooh, wonder what exactly that's for. Maybe for amassing so much power over the course of the game. There are circuits and switches of different colors arranged in a large network. It's reminiscent of a map. One node in the center is labeled Mirage. Hmm. The layout of everything around the town, I guess. Log entry 999. The creature snatched an engineer right in front of me tonight. As it was working to power a room, the creature's hands came out of the darkness and pulled its body into the depths of the mountain. I fled and disabled the doors as I ran. Oh, I hope we're not actually giving the creature more access to the mountain. 
Lost an entire facility of engineers this week. The machine has grown so large that I don't know if they're getting lost or the creature has taken them. I had my first encounter with the creature whose eyes have haunted me. It told me the project will never succeed, that it will do everything it can to stop us. I shouted into the darkness for hours. I cursed at its glowing eyes that it would not take me. I've angered it, and I'm afraid I've made a mistake. We've reached the control panel for the synchronous field. Lights on the discs in the distance blink in a unified pattern. You speak the language and recognize it immediately. The field informs you it's gone into safe mode to protect it from a threat in the mountain. It tells you how the creature came out of the darkness to destroy it, but failed. The field lies dormant waiting for you to call it into action. Speak to the machine. It's so cool. I was about to say, wow, we only have 91,000, but then I just remembered we already did the upgrade from here, which cost us 130,000, so it took a nice chunk of our energy. And let's make sure, yep, synchronous field, we got 12 of 12, only one more support area left to go, the North Star Conduit. Weather system control is the final gauntlet. Yeah, you, you've told us that before. So... We took care of rebooting the synchronous field. It enables wide area distribution of North Star storm regulation. So all of this is seeming to be trying to, you know, weather regulate the system and we're getting closer and closer to actually being in control of it. Next time, North Star Conduit, the last of the support. And yeah, you know what? We'll, we'll play around with the magnetic fork a little bit. If you've enjoyed this episode, make sure to click like and hit that subscribe button, and I will see you guys next time.